sun is sure bright this morning. Well, of course, he's going to Cal Poly. Gee, the toast sure is dry. Well, the toaster's on the fritz. I would one day I'll get into this. Oh, Sid. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. What are we eating this morning? Mm -hmm. Dry toast again. Oh, dry toast? Yes, we're saving for margarine. So, are you ready for the big game today, Brad? Oh, yeah, of course I am. I hope you're going to hit a home run for me, Brad. Well, I'll, I'll try my best. That's all anybody can ask. Except the coach, of course. I'm just worried about this essay in Mr. T's class. What is Ralph up to now? Well, nothing much. Just a major essay on the symbolism of the Old Testament. I hope you'll be divinely inspired. Oh, this is sour. Wow, you should have had a V8. Oh, jeez. Bradley, get back here and finish your toast. Why? It's uh, 19 minutes after the hour. Time for headline sports. Bradley, Carl, you get your rear right back here. And bring the rest of your body, too. I, I, that's not fair. Brad, let me tell you something. As you mature, you'll realize life isn't always fair. Mr. Long, it's you. Who else would it be? James, have I ever told you red isn't your color? Your humanity's last hope. Guard this with your life. Mr. Long, will you hear my final confession? Well, I'm not a priest, but I'll, I'll give it a try. I was a member of a... Of a... Of a... You're tuned to KMFB. This is Todd Robertson bringing you the latest smash hit from Raw Sewage. It's called Search for Sid. Hello, Sid. Why, hello. What's up, Chuck? Get it? Oh, <laughs> yes, a big talk from a little man. If you'll excuse me, I have a job to do. And so do I. Here's my essay, Mr. T. Hey, Zach. What? The Brotherhood. What about him? 
been over two months since you blew up Chuck's lair. So, get to the point, Zach. The point is, Zach, they're up to something. You really think so? Yeah, I really think so. Haven't you noticed? How much? That's funny. I just completed a study of Brotherhood activity, starting in 1965 and extending right through to the present. With the help of my mentor, Mr. Totten, I constructed this graph. Notice, the peaks are increases in Brotherhood activity. The drops, decreases. The lower the drop, the higher the peak. But what does all this mean now, Dan? Well, right now, we're in a period of unprecedented low. So that when they do make their move, it will be big. The biggest? That's essentially correct. To use the scientific phrase, the excrement will soon impact the convection cooler. Whoa. in a very primitive version of the XC12 cryptogram, very similar to a certain cipher that was used by some medieval alchemists. Let me see. I'll try and translate. Modern Latin from Gala. Milk from its white flower. That's deep. Zach. Oh. <laughs> Meet me in one hour in the library mezzanine. Sign. Sit. This is it. Mr. Long? Shh. The walls have ears and other sensory organs. So why did you bring us here, Mr. Long? Shh. Keep it down. It's the Brotherhood. They've got a new plan. What does it involve? The school? No. Global domination. Is that possible? Theoretically, yes. According to my calculations, if the Brotherhood keeps up their present rate of expansion, they will be able to overcome the entire world in eight months, four days, and 43 seconds. Eight months? Yes, eight months. Don't look this way. So what is 